the older generations fell into, especially the mind control, the fear, the inability to think for your own self. Even educated people, you know, for the most part, is people that lack education that don't have the ability to think for themselves, that enjoy being followers. But in Nigeria, because of many other factors that I'm going to get into shortly, even educated people are trapped in a mindset that is just messed up. Um, let me start with this Tinobu guy. Do you know one of the, our prominent members in the Temple of Truth? I'm not going to mention his name. He had a baby in August 28. August 28, that was last month. Right. At the same hospital that Kolu was today. Centuries, yeah. Uh, yes, he had a beautiful baby girl. You know the person I'm talking about. I, I, because he didn't tell me to say it out, out in public. That's why I'm not mentioning it, his name. I he was lost here for three goals. Well, good, good to actually hear. No, but yeah. There, it's a lot yeah. for them in Nigeria to hear that you probably, if ordinary people are actually going to that St. Mary's. Ordinary people, you say, walk in. If you have an appointment there, you go in there. Like everyone else. My ego, this, this our guy, this our guy had a beautiful daughter. He was there for three days, hmm. you know, because I believe it might have been cesarean session. He was there for three days, getting the best treatment. When they got back to their base, they got after home care, nurses coming to visit them at home. And he paid zero pounds, yep. zero pounds. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the same hospital that when Tinubu comes to every single day, trust me, this guy is spending tens of thousands of pounds no per day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when, when Mayegun calls um, the Abobakus or anybody that chooses to worship all these criminals, when, they, when he calls you a blatant fool, an absolute moron, you deserve to be called that name because if you are struggling to get medical treatment in Luth, in a national hospital, Abuja, in all those other garbage hospitals littered across the country, and you have no access to nothing, MRI is costing you 300,000 Naira. Mm -hmm. There are all the doctors. A doctor has to attend to 5,000 patients, and you are supporting a criminal that met a system where his predecessor, Buhari, did the same thing. Oh, Went to London multiple times, spent millions of pounds on medical situation and now he's doing the same thing and you still choose to support him you're an absolute fool but um let me just i don't want to take too much time i i need to quickly summarize some reasons why people um why a lot of our people unfortunately are trapped in a mental space in a, in a cube they just can't think outside the box no matter how educated they are they are afraid they can't even criticize their their, their, their religious leaders that blatantly steal their money they are afraid they say ah why do you talk this way? Ah, the way they opened their mouth, ah. Africa Wala. Ah. When you say something, you say, ah. I need to say the whole world is going to swallow. <laughs> like, ah. Why did you say that? Ah. Say, shut up, close it. You know? See, but my God, most people love being being followers. Unfortunately, it's the human psychology and the vast majority of human beings will rather be followers during their lifetimes than to become leaders. It's difficult being a leader. So it's not, it's understandable if an average person wants to be a follower. I get it. But even within you being a follower, you should have the ability to reject some things. And some of the reasons why people, um, choose to stay within the safe space of being followers and being afraid to say the truth is because they just find a sense of security if they are controlled or if they are provided for by someone else. It's unfortunate. Now in a Nigerian context where, and I'm so sorry I'm taking so much time because I feel like I'm shooting way beyond my time. In a Nigerian context where um, um, it's unfortunate, but the people that you are given the power to control your lives, they are criminals. And no matter how much we say it, some of you will never listen. You believe that they are the right people for you. But unfortunately, that's all it is. That's, you have to deal with that situation. But you guys in large numbers are also affecting us negatively. Yes. A lot of people also, they like being followers because they like avoiding responsibility. They just don't want to take 
they don't want to be responsible for that. They would just rather give that responsibility to someone else. And a lot of people lack confidence. They have low self-esteem. You know, the poverty in this in the society has made these people not even believe in themselves. You know, they see the son of an El Rufai, a common thug, and they worship him because the guy drives a Benz. Because this guy drives a Mercedes Benz, they're like, ah, I want to have money like Sheyi Tunubu. You know, it's unfortunate, but that's just the unfortunate situation of our country. And I hope people can pay attention to some of these things when you can't catch yourself implementing it in your lives. Try and consciously reverse that. And that's all I'm going to say. So I don't take too much time. Okay, thank, thank you so you. much, my good for time. I appreciate time. that too, right, man? You have a good one, okay? The African and you too. Allah. I have another caller here. Um, hello. Hey, my good. Good hello, evening. Sir. Is that talk? I mean, talks. I like to come speaking. Fantastic. You haven't changed your DP, so it makes it easier for me then, Baba. How are you? Uh, I won't change you. You know, I really didn't change my DP because of you, because every time I get a show, uh, I'm a major I like that. Yeah, I'm a major regular, and I've seen you, and you've, you've actually not complained or moaned about it, but when DPs change, you think, oh, no, who is that person? I say, no. And sometimes uh, yeah. you call in that way, and you're like, do you know who is talking? I'm like, I don't. I'm sorry. And I'm like, uh -huh. oh, it's a lot of kumbas. Oh, yeah. I do. How are you doing, Shababa? It's good to hear from you. I'm fine. Um, to be honest with you, I actually came back from that contraption mm. last week. How was it? And I was there for about four weeks or five weeks. Oh. My God. To be honest with you, people are suffering. Um... It's all, it's unbelievable. I mean, I didn't join the show from the beginning. I joined it a bit late. And I I I I think I think I joined when um uh, you were talking about Shatima going to Borono State and everything. Look, my God, the truth of the matter is that 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 country is not a country anymore. And I tell people that the one mistake that the president made was subsidy is gone. You don't do that when you have no cabinet, no ministers, no advisors, no nothing. He was off script on there, and that's what we need to today. I was buying petrol at 920 naira per liter. It's unheard of. I've said I've said this before, I will say it again. Our problem in Nigeria is local. It's not to do with currency conversion. It's nothing to do with that. If you drop the price of fuel to 100 or 200 naira per liter, price of food will drop, people will be happy. But you see, when people are so greedy... That's the same day they make that announcement, right? Uh, in another yeah. 24 hours, food prices will drop by more than 50%. Guaranteed. My room, mm -hmm. The woman, the, the farmer bringing her tomatoes from um, Oshun State to, let's say, Ibadan or whatever, the price of fuel drops, it will drop. Everything drops from there. Our problem is local. We have we have what they call a, a food crops and cash crops. Cash crops is what we send out to sell after we've had our fuel. We don't have that anymore. People are concerned. I, I said, Gary, I went to the market just to see, okay, my ego talks on the show and everything. Okay, let me walk into the market in my locality mm -hmm. and see. A small basket of a, a pepper, 500 naira. When I was now buying stuff, they, they were looking like, ah, who is this person? Hmm. Emily, 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 what? I was buying. My ego people are suffering. People are literally suffering. I saw it first time. I came back last week. My ego people are suffering. And let me tell you something, my ego. I'm sorry, but I'm also so afraid as well. Even kind of speak my going the blowback on this is coming very soon. Hmm. Tenbu cannot do a second term. Let me let me let, let's just let's just cancel it now. It's not going to the second term. But let me tell you to the blowback when it comes, my going, I'm telling you, everything you said is going to come to pass. I don't know how you did it or whether you have a crystal ball somewhere, but everything you said is going to come to pass. Hmm. 
I, I will never forget the time that I went to Princess and one or two other people to schools in Ogun State. And I saw children suffering. And this was then like about people, three years ago. Imagine what it is yes. going to be like now, sending our people my God, to my God. again. I don't even want to even I don't want to even think or even project my mind that far. I will say to you today, what I saw then, it broke my heart so much that I wish I could win the lottery tonight and say, you know what? Ogun State, where I'm from, let me take over Ogun State. Let us make this student better. Because my look at it. There are a lot of children they have they have massive aspiration, massive thoughts for their own future, but they don't have the equipment and the quality of life to make it better. I told somebody today here when I was when I was at work, I said, look, everything people are praying for in Nigeria, hmm. it it comes to pass the day you step in the UK here. Legitimately, oh Miniko, oh Kamala, you you come here legitimately. You have good roads, you have electricity 24-7. If you charge your lights, you know you go draw. Mm -hmm. Healthcare. If somebody has accident today, God forbid, even if that is, is illegitimately being in this country, they will take care of him. That's what they call duty of care. Take care of that person, make sure he's alive, him after the fact. But in Nigeria, I, I lost a friend a couple of years ago, had a heart attack. Wow. I didn't read me very well. So sorry, man. Three hospitals in Lekki there, they went to, they refused this guy. Ordinary CPR, they can't do. But here, they teach CPR every single day. Every train station, every hospital, every restaurant, every bar has got a defibrillator. We don't get for like that. No, no, Baba. Defibrillator. I mean, I never knew how important that thing uh, is, Baba. Until I, I, will, I read somewhere that... Uh, it's almost like non-existent in Nigeria. And it's so it's not my, 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 even if it's existent in Nigeria, can they manage it? You have to change the battery and the parts for the chest every two years. On law, forget it. Based on law, every two years, over the change it every two years. But okay, in Nigeria, mismanagement. We have no management regime in that country. To my budget, always must care. A lot more work at to say. Look at that dam that broke. Yeah. I, did, I I was on your last show, and I said, ah, my parojali, my goes. I want to do research. Moka was already ah. What my yeah. said is true. Mm. How did this happen? That said, guy that was standing by the dam is, there, and the water, the, the water was spewing out. Mm. I had a friend in Lagos, and he has a fish farm. I don't say the area because they I know who is talking. Mm. All of a sudden, they released the dam in Ogun State without telling these guys. And he flooded these guys' dam. Would they be with their salo? How do people do this? How do people do this? They come and she dam, Nikki. Oh, she dam, Jerry. Oh, my God. I don't know how you do it. Talks. Thank you very much, right? I don't know how you do it. I don't know what you do. But my, what you're doing is real. I felt the impact when I went home of recent. All I want to say is just thank you and thank everybody on this platform. Keep raising our Please share this video. Uh, share continue, this video. Like this video. Mm -hmm. If you want to abuse my ego, abuse my ego. You are in jail. 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 Let me to everybody there too. Now that's that. Uh, talking about that dam, I have another call on the line, right? Or I kind of, uh, I'm trying to bring up uh, the picture of, uh, from the dam on our screen. But while I take this call, right, I'll do just that. Uh, hello there. Hello dear, Baba. Ah, Martinelli. <laughs> How far, Baba? I just did. Uh, How you doing? Baba, we are good day for it though. I did can't be. I stand giddy, but no shake it, Baba. See us, see us, you see trouble. Kalu is here, and right now we have uh, Boko Haram. I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why. Why these people? Why be say when it be say I did for that party in nine days or only Buruku come they come a week later. I had my baby there. Now me Africa one are they talking? About? I was there just two weeks ago. I had my oh daughter. Do you want the baby? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't have the baby. 
contract. Co I got. Uh, sorry, give me a sec. Sorry, what? I think I just mixed something up there. Martinelli. That's all right. Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, man. Thanks, Baba. Thanks, thanks. So I was there, and I'm seeing some people. They are saying. Yeah, it's free now, but it's a lifetime of tax and NI. Mm. But do you also realize that there are people in this country who don't work and who don't pay taxes, but they get the same benefit that people who pay taxes and Absolutely. who work get? Mm. Like, it's called socialism. Everybody, you know, me, you bring your own come, everybody will join it together, and everybody will chop. That's how they do it. That's how you run an economy. That's right. You know, you use different, different, you, a little bit of capitalism, a little bit of socialism, a little bit of everything. You mix it together to make the economy work. The if it's getting... Mm -hmm. You want to say to make it to be fair for everybody, but some people don't understand. Like you know, I was talking about that same parenting. You know, when I was there in Saint Mary's, that Lindo wing that Kolu went to yep. is the same yeah. wing that um, you know when the um, Charles and when all these uh, royal families Charles, when, when they, they had their kids, right? That way. But guess what? Mm. The north, uh, the nurses that attended to me, that attended to my family. Yes, they told me. They said that wing. It's not upgraded. It's not like it's 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 not as standard as the wing that we're in, because mm. the wing is not for general. You know, it's not for the general public and what you know, people like who pay taxes go to. It's for people who don't pay taxes, wow. like the real, the real family don't pay taxes. So that's where they use. So. Those when they pay taxes, their facility no better reach me where they use taxes, where they pay taxes. That's what the nurses said. The nurses said they prefer to work. I, I, I had my baby in the Cambridge wing. I don't know. Somebody, had, I think Miss Flora said she's worked there. So she knows the Cambridge wing. That's where I had my baby. It's amazing. So, so uh, I was, uh, lady, yeah, Lady Flora, she said something yeah. about that same wing she as well, yeah? She worked there. So she, oh, she works there. Yeah, she was there for 22 years. So she knows she know exactly what I'm talking about. Wow. Bro. Sir. As I can't begin to explain. I when I was there, I called one tramper and I was showing him the video out. I video call one tramper. If one tramper went there for Yankee, they jealous me. Say, ah, you know, say, oh my, your own say, oh my, don't want Yankee to jealous me. Say, you know? bro, I yeah. no patience buying. <laughs> you don't have to. You bro, know what I mean? When, when, when we had the, the see, when we had the, uh, our second child here, yeah, right? You uh, one day, okay. Uh, it happens to be when uh, they have uh, upgraded our, we used to call it a Southern General Hospital, okay? Then we changed it to Queen Elizabeth uh, Hospital, uh, sorry, Hospital, right? Yeah. It's one of the top best hospitals in the entire Europe. In case if you have, I, I'm not sure if it's even not pretty much like a, a sort of a bigger or better than St. Mary's, right? I, yeah. you know, here in Glasgow here, when they did the upgrade, right? They have to measure it with that of other top European uh, hospitals. Okay? Hospitals, yeah. But when they, yeah. when we had uh, my daughter, well, even at year in sorrow, all right, right? What is Gio Mokro? No coin. What is Gekuro? Baba, we are still talking. <laughs> Tell me, so, bro. Me, you know, I I mentioned one thing to you here the first time. The yeah. first time I called you, I said what well, I, I said one thing. I said no matter how much the bee try to explain to the fly that pollen is better than shit. Baba, you saw what you are saying now, Baba. Yeah. I promise you, if you, Baba, continue explaining for the next six hours. Baba, some people, they don't go see or understand. I didn't go to me, uh, uh, why, don't you, why don't you bring that back to Nigeria and do you the understand? same thing? You understand? Somebody is saying, I'm paying taxes. It's a life I'm life I'm of the biggest hospital night. Are you, are, are you normal? No. Uh, we are talking about Kolu. The people who have the capacity I, to build it. And you are I, condemning me for calling them out. Now you are asking me to come and build the same thing. Share it here with everybody. My ego, uh -huh. as I'm talking to you right now, my uh -huh. daughter is in the hospital again. She had we had the little scare a couple of days ago. So she's been at the hospital for like five days now. Yes, sir. She's okay. There's nothing wrong with her. She's okay. She's under observation. Like after after care. Yeah. Hmm. yeah, so it's after care. So we had the scare. She had a little cut under her armpit. So we took her to the hospital and they said, well, you know what? We don't want but, but nothing to do my picking, no. She, there's nothing wrong with her. That she's just she's been in OBS, she's been on OBS for five days at Brighton Hospital because that's where my partner's family live. They live in Brighton. So we went to visit right. them when we noticed. Baba, but in Mode Brighton, Baba, who did in Bessekon, Baba, 40, no, sorry, it was 12 story building mm. hospital. They built because the hospital is from the hospital, from the top of the hospital, you'll be looking at, you'll be overlooking Brighton. Oh, the entire Baba, thing. they built the hospital they, as in the concept. Oh, I think Cotton, they are. Uh. They are expanding it. They are doing some one or two expand expansion. 
apparently they are trying to make it look like a ship so that when you are on the sea and you are looking at the land, you'll be seeing it will look like a ship. I, I don't, Baba. Wow. But I say when I look at the hospital, it means for me I begin to cry like to you all know. Now, bro, like how can you, you go, how you don't go hate those criminals destroying so, Nigeria? Tell me now, how do you begin to explain that to people? How? How do you explain? Where do you even start how from? Do, and where do you begin? Where because do you explain? Sometimes you actually need how? to experience it. How? You, you, you need them to experience it. Yeah. Before, so you, before you can even say anything. I, or else, I, then, I where do you want to start from? You can't. You can't explain to people. And that's why I say, oh, now, now, Sabi, oh, I mean, if not like, the only thing they say, I will continue talking, I will continue trying to explain to you, but I, I know so you don't go understand, but while I'm in here, you don't go understand. You can't, you can never get it. See, call you, come on, St. Mary's Web is a day for here for how many days? In fact, I discharge myself because we have, we have to go home, go to the hospital to soon be my house, get that password. I said, make I go out. And they said, no, stay, make observe, don't worry, come. Said the nurse came to my house. The nurse came to my house to come and it's do the same thing. Now. Now. She started nursery now, right? Yesterday, the health worker was still in our house, right? They are there yeah. checking. They are now they are my, checking our speech. Why? How do you here? explain that to somebody in Nigeria? Yeah. What does Nigeria keep on with the health visit? Where I see how are they are they para? What is this girl doing in my house? Yeah, so discussing discussing why is my child my daughter is not talking yeah, so clearly like right? so I feel yeah. they have to ban why are you here yeah, yeah. they are still here checking yeah. on that that's it bro so my please how do you explain this one even a multi millionaire in Nigeria how do you explain this even though the big urban itself with all the millions and millions you cannot understand they can't they don't get it so that's why you know people like us will continue thanking you, will continue you know, continue saying, "Baba, God bless you." Even in your own, in your own, like in your own down, in your own downtime, like that they are supposed to be recovering. Like, Baba, as you come back, no day after you, I told them to take at least like a few days off, like relax. Yeah. But then they were you know, like, uh, you know, they were like, uh, clinically, I was so good. I'm I fine. know, I know. But I if know. I choose to want to stay, it's up to me. And as I know, I'm not staying. You know. And no, that's no. it. That, that's it. That's it. You know, that's it. Like they'll give you all the options. Like yes, you no. and doctor, when I go stand, when I go, they talk. They will give you your options, and they'll tell you this is okay. This, nothing do you. You can go home and you use your medication, but we would like you to stay here. To we'll let you open up. Sir, Baba G J M M R O is three square yes. minutes and snack in between. Baba, politicians the come here to come and use that same our like, NHS. Yeah. Oh. Eh? Oh. And we never what tell the people that you deserve the same thing. You deserve, but when I saw your you see, all these hospitals, eh, they can, if they and use and one billion pounds, eh, they can build something close to that St. Mary's Hospital Baba, eh, Baba, in Nigeria. The price, the amount of money that they used to build St. Mary's Hospital, go yeah. online now. Yeah. It's yeah. not that, up that to the money that they have. Your heart most. Oh, so you, you know reach the amount of money where you have a load on thief. Yeah, the thief. And that will break your heart most. In, Baba, I think, when I... Brighton Hospital, Baba, that is not the best hospital in the UK. Brighton yeah. Hospital is yeah. not the best. Baba, I look at the hospital, Baba, 14-story building. Baba, I, my heart sunk. Because I sat down, I think I, th I thought to myself, like, I don't think something like this exists in the whole of Africa, as big as Africa. I don't, I highly doubt it. Baba, you will be driving for minutes, I will say hours. You are my one more to know by. You are still with the military. I mean, you are still inside the hospital, the Baba. Ambulance go take it from one building, then they oh, take it to another one. It will be let's say you travel. God. Ah, bro. I say I even called my somebody in America. I'm showing him and he's looking like ah ah. Oh, how much? How much? Oh, that's all America. Me wa ori osu tu wa rembi o. Oh no. Somebody for Yankee, they even they jealous me when they UK. And then you want you, my ego, you want to explain to somebody in Nigeria, but they don't go understand now. You know, they don't go. But you know, we know you keep trying, and we hope one day. Only one mark, pay. Only one during your body, pay. Thank you so much, Martinelli. Baba, Thank you I'm very much, Michael. God bless you, Baba. And then uh, say me well to Yahoo. By the way, one yeah. Baba, by the way, right now. Thank you very much, Baba. Bless you, sir. Thank you so much as well. That's uh, Martinelli, ladies and gentlemen. I have another call on the line, and here we go. Uh, hello there. 
the general. Buy yes. a good general. CA. My own person from yeah, Atlanta. From Atlanta. Is that you? Yeah. Exactly, man. That's me. Fantastic, sir. How are you? My, I'm I'm okay, my mm -hmm. I like when you I like when you put that your short clip. Anarchy looms. Mayabu. Wala de. Wala wa. Anarchy 